everyone! Welcome back to Rita Roo Kids. My name is Miss Christy, and today I'm so excited to share another awesome book with you. If you're as excited as I am, be sure to give this video a thumbs up below and don't forget to click subscribe. That way, every time we post a new story, you and I can read together again right away. We also have activities that go along with our books every single month. So to get those, head over to readaroukids.com. All right, today's book is called Secrets of Winter, a Shine a Light book by Karen Brown and Georgina T. As I read this book, I'll be turning the lights on and off to show you the secrets behind the snow. Let's get started. Secrets of Winter by Karen Brown, illustrated by Georgina T. A winter's night is bustling with life. If you look closely through the dark trees, around the icy river, and in the snowy hollows, you will spot lots of activity. Shine a torch behind the page or hold it up to the light to reveal what is hidden in a wintry nighttime woodland. Discover a world of great surprises. In the autumn, many trees lose their leaves. Can you see who is sleeping here? Let's see who is sleeping. Ooh, what do we see? Does it look like a bee? I think so. Let's see. Bzz, shh. This bumblebee scooped out a hole in the earth. She will sleep until spring. Snow is falling. Look closely at the flakes. Can you see their shapes? Let's see. What do we see? The shape of the snowflake. How many arms does it have? One, two, three, four, five, six. What a beautiful snowflake. Every snowflake has six sides, but each has a different pattern. Whoosh! What has landed in the tree? Let's see. There they are. Does it look like blue jays maybe? Can you see? A flock of wax wings. They eat the tree's berries. Oh, they're called wax wings. This wax wing has found a berry on the ground. Who is sleeping under the rock? Let's see who's sleeping. <gasps> Looks like a frog sleeping under the rock. A wood frog is asleep. The icy weather might freeze the frog, but it will thaw out again. Snow covers the land. What has made these tracks? Who? What made the tracks? <sighs> Looks like a bunny. A bunny made the tracks, see? Burr, a hare bunches up to keep warm. Her white fur hides her in the snow. In the summer, her fur is brown. A red squirrel keep, a red squirrel peeps inside the tree. What is he looking for? Let's see. <gasps> Looks like there's some nuts. They've gathered for the winter. Crunch! There's a store of nuts in a hollow. The nuts were hidden here in the autumn. These catskins are the seeds of a birch tree. Who is eating them? Let's see who's eating them. Ooh, it looks like a bird is eating them. I don't know what kind of bird, but definitely some type of bird is eating them. Let's find out. A grouse. She has extra feathers on her feet. They are like snowshoes. Ivy covers this tree. There are creatures asleep here. Can you see them? Let's find out who's asleep in the tree. Oh, 
It looks like snails. Snails are asleep in the tree. Tiny snails curl up inside their shells all winter. They seal themselves in so they don't dry out. A fox is asleep on the snow. Can you see her face? We can't see it yet because it's covered by the tail. There she is, fast asleep. The fox's big bushy tail keeps her face and paws warm. The lake is frozen, but something is moving under the ice. Can you see anything? Can't see it yet. There they are, the fish under the ice. Most fish lie near the bottom of the lake. The water is warmer here. Evergreen trees have leaves all year round. Who is sheltering from the snow? Let's see who's sheltering. Ooh, it's deer. The deer are sheltering. A family of deer is eating the new leaves on the trees. Munch. Red berries shine bright against the snow. Who will eat this fruit? Who's going to eat it? Looks like a little mouse. Berries make a tasty meal for a mouse. He can climb to reach fruit higher up. The mouse is running to hide. Can you see why? Uh-oh, why is he running? Oh my, it looks like an owl. An owl might be chasing after the mouse. Swoop, the mouse has spotted a hungry owl just in time. The owl eats small animals. Another creature is hiding from the owl. Can you see it? Uh-oh, what's in there? What's hiding inside the log? It's a weasel standing in the hollow of an old tree. He is very good at hiding. There's a large hole under this old tree. Take a look inside. Oh, wow, look who's in the hole of the tree. It looks like a little bear family. Bears sleep all winter. They will wake up in spring when there are lots of insects to eat. As the sun rises, the nighttime animals go to sleep while the daytime creatures wake up. The animals that sleep through the winter will doze until spring. I loved reading with you today, and I hope that we can read together again soon. To make sure that we can do that, be sure to click the subscribe button below and don't forget to give this book a like. That way we know you wanna see more books just like this from us. If you'd like activities to go along with our books, you can head over to readaroukids.com. There we do all kinds of fun things like science experiments, arts and crafts. We even practice our math and reading skills. We cook together. We have so much fun. So I hope you'll come on over there and join me. If you'd like to see what we're up to every day, you can head over to all of our social media. Again, I loved reading with you today, and I hope that we can read together again soon. Until then, Rita Roo loves you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.